today. Welcome to Kingdom Devotions. Today's scripture verse is from the book of Ephesians, chapter 3, verse 6 to 7. This mystery is that the Gentiles are fellow heirs, members of the same body, and partakers of the promise in Christ Jesus through the gospel. Of this gospel, I was made a minister according to the gift of God's grace, which was given me by the working of his power. Amen. You know, Paul was called by Jesus to be ministering to the Gentiles so that they will also receive the gift of God's grace through faith in Christ Jesus. God's salvation plan is for all nations, every people, tribe, and tongue. And here in verse 6, we see that Gentiles, us believers, receiving the same promise as the Jews. Let's take a look. Firstly, Gentiles are fellow heirs with Jews in the inheritance of God. Second, Gentiles are fellow members of the same body of Christ, which is the church with Jesus as the head. And thirdly, Gentiles are fellow partakers of the promise of Christ Jesus through the gospel. What are those promises? The forgiveness of sins, fellowship of the Holy Spirit, and last but not least, whosoever believes will not perish, but have eternal life. Wow. Aren't you glad that God called Paul to minister to the Gentiles? You know, in 1 Corinthians chapter 12, verse 13, it says that for in one spirit, we were all baptized into one body, Jews or Greeks, slave or free, and all were made to drink of one spirit. You know, friends, we have a purpose. Our purpose is to spread the gospel of the good news of God in verse 10 to 12. It says here, so that through the church, the manifold wisdom of God might now be made known to the rulers and authorities in the heavenly places. This was according to the eternal purpose that he has realized in Christ Jesus our Lord, in whom we have boldness and access with confidence through our faith in Him. So, are you telling others about Jesus? You know, this is the purpose and calling that God has given us so that we can minister as well to the nations. Let us pray. Dear me, Father, you are the great I am. Thank you that we can call you Abba Father. Holy Spirit, empower us with boldness to be witnesses for Christ Jesus so that others can receive the gift of your grace. In your name I pray. Amen.